Georgetown family continues to give back to the community 10 years after their daughter's horrific accident. Katie Eddington survived a lawnmower accident at age four, causing doctors to have to amputate her right leg. Hannah Jackson talked with the family about the significance of this day and why they continue to give back. In 2013, the Eddington family experienced the unimaginable, a father accidentally running over his little girl with a lawnmower. At age four, Katie was rushed to the hospital and after 22 surgeries, limb salvage for two years, the doctors performed an elective amputation. Today, Friday 13th, 2023, marks 10 years since the accident, and Katie said those years have taught her a lot. Word of advice is probably just to push through it. That's all you can do. It's Time will heal itself, and that's, that's all you can do is just push through it. Trials and tribulations, two words the Eddington family would use to describe this past decade as they have all had to adjust to a new normal. It's really important to try to find the silver lining and sometimes it's really difficult. I'm not saying that I haven't found it, but sometimes, sometimes there's not one. And so if you can't just immediately find one, sometimes you have to make one. And so it was a few years before I realized that life was gonna go back to some sort of normalcy. And so I kind of chose to find or create a silver lining in some form or fashion every year. So every year on the anniversary of the accident, the family gives back to the community. And so it was it's something we've done every year. And originally, again, I wanted to give back, but it was something to kind of distract us from the day and try to not be so sad. And then it just kind of turned into something that we do every year. This year, the Eddingtons are paying it forward with the Katie Gives Back Blood Drive to help those who helped her. All day Friday, community members stop by to donate in Katie's honor. Her mom says it was Katie's choice and one the family hopes will help those who need it. In Georgetown, Hannah Jackson, Fox 56 News.